of famous men our ancestors on the special day we give glory and praise to god almighty for the wonderful gift of our patroness saint anne saints anne and joachim were the parents of mother mary and grandparents of jesus christ today let us reflect saint's life and values and emulate in our lives happy are those who make the lord their trust and means grace saint anne was born in bethlehem and married joachim from nazareth in galilee saint anne and joachim were very pious and devoted couple They trusted God totally and took delight in observing his commandments. They were the doers of the word of God. Their life was God-centered life. Happy are those who consider the poor. Saints were very rich, yet they were very humble. Mother Mary's father Joachim was a wealthy member of one of the 12 tribes of Israel. He was a shepherd given the task of supplying the temple of Jerusalem with sheep for sacrifices. The saint couple did not take pride in their wealth for they acknowledged everything was from God. and lived a life of gratitude to heavenly father love each other just as i have loved you the holy couple were very generous they wholeheartedly believed that the fulfillment of loving god was in the service of humanity thus they divided their property into three parts and offered one portion to temple another to poor and kept the third part for themselves many are the afflictions of the righteous but the lord rescues them all the pious couple had a great cross to bear after 20 years of their marriage they had no children childlessness was regarded as a sign of curse and shame people's ridicule and humiliation caused them great grief but the trust they placed in god helped them to be calm and steady at the moments of crisis this great pain insults and hurting words did not shake their faith rather they rigorously prayed with fasting and penance for their trust was nothing is impossible with god suffering brought them more closer to god with hope they committed their life to god and trusted that god would act Blessed are those who mourn for they will be comforted. The saints' unwavering trust and perseverance were highly rewarded by God. The Lord who knows the pain and hears the cry fulfilled their hearts' desires and blessed them with a noble daughter Mary. A tree is known by its fruit. 
saint parents instructed mother mary all the virtues to be a worthy mother of jesus the savior they wholeheartedly accepted the design of god by dedicating and sacrificing their only daughter for the service of god mother mary learned to place complete trust in god alone and was able to say yes to god's plan and thus became the channel of salvation of human kind that is to bring forth jesus christ to the world today let us pray for the virtue of trust saint anne you taught mother mary to place complete trust in god pray for us to have trust in god accept and surrender to the will of god always the feast day of saints anne and joachim 26th july is celebrated as grandparents day let us remember and pray for our grandparents and elderly people dear saint anne our beloved patroness intercede for our families management reverend sisters staff students and all who seek your intercession amen